The time has come again, remember when we were getting those Battlefront updates that were including a lot of skins and I was adding up all the prices in order to see how much you would all need to save up for the updates? Well yes, I'm bringing them back, we've had a few updates where there's not really been any skins, so yes, let's get back into these everyone. It's time to get mathematical with FGG. Also, I want to give a big shout out to the community manager Ben Walk because the information on the latest community transmission wasn't too clear about some of these skins, so he's clarified it for me on Twitter, so big thank you to him. Let's get into things. So, the June update for Battlefront 2. As listed on the community transmission, we will be getting the general Skywalker appearance. This will be epic and it'll be 40,000 credits or 1,000 crystals. We'll also be getting the 41st Scout Battalion. This will be epic once again. And these will be 40,000 credits or 1,000 crystals. And then finally, the 212th Recon Division, which are gonna be rare. And these are going to be 20,000 credits or 500 crystals. Now Ben has confirmed on Twitter that the two new sets of Clone Legions will be available for each class, meaning that for the 41st, we're going to have to pay 40,000 credits or 1,000 crystals four times, and for the 212th, we're going to have to pay 20,000 credits or 500 crystals four times as well if you want it for each class. So let's go through this. Anakin skin, 40,000. 41st skins on top of that, times by 4, so times that 40,000 by 4, we're coming out with 160,000, and then the 212th, we're timesing that 20,000 by 4, and that's giving us 80,000. Then same with the crystals here, so we're going to take Anakin's 1,000 crystals, then the 41st, obviously times that 1,000 by 4, giving us 4,000 crystals, and then the 212th, taking that 500 crystals, timesing that by 4, 2,000. So overall, the highest we are going to be paying in this update is going to be 280,000 credits or 7,000 crystals. And by the way, I think the crystals is very overpriced. I can see why people do this with credits usually. However, there is a big but here. Credit bundles. Ben didn't confirm, even though I mentioned it in the tweet, if we would be getting a credit bundle or not. So I'm guessing he doesn't know. But these could potentially happen. Now, obviously, to my knowledge, I don't believe you can buy the credit bundles with crystals. However, if we look at this potential credit bundle outcome here, we're going to take Anakin's skin. Now, Anakin's is on its own, so no bundle included. That's going to be 40,000. Set that 40,000 down. Now, usually what they do with these bundles is if there's four skins, which there always is, they basically give you one for free. So if we go to the 41st, Obviously, it's going to be 40,000 for each skin, but we're going to knock off 40,000. So we're just going to do 40,000 times by three. That's going to give us 120,000. And then we're going to do the same thing with the 212. So we're just going to do 20,000 times by three, giving us 60,000. And then if we add all this together, if we do potentially get bundles, the final outcome price could be 220,000 credits. Now overall, I like the sound of this credits wise. I love being able to spend my credits on skins. I really do enjoy it. It's unfortunate that most of us have got so many credits that this isn't really gonna make a dent in our accounts. It will make one in mine, I will admit. But uh, I'm looking forward to it. I think we've got some really cool skins coming in this update. I'm really excited and admittedly, I have missed these updates where there's a bunch of skins being added that we've got to spend our credits on. I wish they do these every month so I could bring these calculations to you. But yeah, thank you very much for watching everyone. I do hope this video helps you out. Once again, thank you to Ben because I nearly had to cancel this video for another week because the community transmission just wasn't very clear. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time.